starting with some latest developments coming in from New Delhi, where Prime Minister Narendra Modi-led selection committee has finalized the names of two new election commissioners weeks ahead of the general elections in the country. Leader of Opposition Adirandan Chaudhary, who was part of the three-member committee containing one more cabinet minister, has revealed the names of the selected poll officials. After the meeting that ended minutes ago, Adiranjan said Supir Sandhu and Kianesh Kumar have been selected as the new election commissioners. The committee met to fill vacancies in the three-member poll body after former election commissioner Arun Goel resigned from his post last week. Earlier in February, the tenure of former election commissioner Anup Chandra Pandey's this left a uh, three-member constitutional body with just the chief election commissioner Rajiv uh, Kumar. Joining me on the broadcast is my colleague Siddharth Sibyl. For more details, Siddharth, what are you picking up on the latest information that we're getting on the selection of the election commissioners? Well, this is a significant development. Uh, we know that India goes to elections uh, very soon. Uh, it's just a matter of time that the Indian uh, government, uh, the Indian Election Commission, in fact, uh, announces uh, the dates of the election, which is going to take place for at least minimum two months. Now, we know that uh, there was a vacancy which arose after the resignation for one of the election commissioners. And now, after the meeting that took place, uh, it has been uh, um, announced that the uh, bureaucrats, Yanesh Kumar, uh, and uh, Subir Singh Kandu are appointed as election commissioners. So there are three election commissioners now. Yanesh Kumar um, is a retired IS officer of uh, the uh, Kerala cadre, and he was someone who oversaw the abrogation of Article 370 uh, being in the Kashmir division of uh, the MHA, that's the Ministry of uh, Home Affairs. And the uh, uh, second uh, person who has been appointed, Subir Singh Kandu, um, he was an officer of 1988 batch, Uttarakhand Kada, and he has, of course, held many important positions, both in the central government, um, both in the governments of uh, Uttarakhand, Uttar Pradesh, and, of course, Punjab as well. Uh, so significant development coming ahead, uh, uh, even as the election commission is all set to announce uh, uh, the dates of uh, uh, the election when uh, it will uh, take place, and it's a matter of time now. Siddharth Sibyl joining us in the broadcast. Thank you so much for giving us all those details. We'll be continue tracking all the poll-related stories from India very closely. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.